Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Nuremic, and oh boy, do I have a story for you all. So first and foremost, welcome back to Crossing New Horizons. It is the 21st of August, 2021. Now, ooh, there have been little, there have been little breadcrumbs dropped around the last few uh, episodes of this, but they've kind of reached a heading point today. Um, so, as you may or may not have known, I announced that I, uh, I had a job interview at KFC. It was either in a previous video, but I think it was... It's more on brand for me to say this type of stuff in, like, Animal Crossing, for example. It's, it's a cool way to fill dead air. You know, I, I like to think, like, all of my videos are, like, one big cohesive timeline and story you can follow along if you're committed enough. But no, um, in a previous episode, I said I had applied to KFC. And then, um, I think in a following episode... Or maybe not. No, I'm pretty sure one of the episodes recently I mentioned I had a interview type thing at KFC. And it was at 11 o'clock in the morning today. Mmm. So, um, I turned up, like, I have, I was, I was like, I'm not gonna, like, say I was super stressed out of my mind, but I was there, like, okay, 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 right, you know, when was it made? By the way, it was 1952 in Utah. Salt City, I think. <laughs> see, see, I was doing all this research, like, you know, what's your biggest flaw? Just typical review, you know, interview style questions, because... Believe it or not, I, I wanted a job. We can have this channel, like, have a good job. You know, like, for, for a while, we've honestly been scraping by on birthday money, Christmas money, and, like, intuition. That's, that's about it, really. Um, actually, no, we'll get rid of these boppers, because uh, I, I don't seem to have a reason for me to keep wearing them past a certain point. Yeah, just, they're not, not clicking with me. They're, this balloon has it, though, so we're keeping that one. So those. But no, I, I want the job. It means I have, like, more money for just, like, myself and doing fun, cool things, days out and whatnot. Uh, it means this channel has more of a budget. Um, like I said, as I was saying, you know, we've been going by on, like, OBS, you know, birthday, Christmas money. Um, you know, like, and then just, like, consoles I already had. And, like, the extra equipment I do have. Uh, you know, like, say, keyboard, mouse, uh, blue snowball, catch card. I saved up, and I saved up predominantly, at least in the past, by just kind of doing chores, helping around the house. But obviously, if I want to, like, majorly upgrade the content this channel has, then I, I need a kind of, I need a job. Especially, say, if I want to try out new content consistently, like, thank you for the support on the Dead by Daylight video, by the way. But, you know, if I want to consistently try out new content, then I need a budget, uh, which I'm quite happy to announce I now have. Yeah, it turned out that interview wasn't so much of an interview as it was, right, we're just getting the details, what days you can and can't work. Your first shift is Monday at 10 a.m. So I'm sat there, um, completely stunned. And it took about 10 minutes. Like, I'm not complaining in the slightest that I got the job. Like, apparently, they just either really watched my interview or someone I know works there put a good word in for me. And luckily, they don't know about my channel, so that is a major positive. <laughs> it's, uh, now, if, if someone at my work found my channel, no, no, no. Uh, but no, uh, the fuck's done. I got the job, and I'm uh, I'm quite happy about it. I think I'd share it with you guys because you guys are as much a part of my life as uh, say my uh, yeah my, my close friends are. And plus, if I say this on video, that's kind of it's, like I said, big cohesive story. It's like you know, it's 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 a new major plot point type thing if you follow my gist. Yeah, yeah. But no, I'm extremely happy actually that I, uh, I was able to get the job. Uh, if you know me, or even if you've listened to fair enough of these videos, yeah, these plot lines they keep they keep coming back to haunt us in this one. Like, I'm, I, I am always in KFC. Like, you know, it's become a running joke that I just, I know every KFC thing off the top of my head, so it's like, working there, you know, getting like, I think some on my lunch break, plus like, discounts and whatnot. Honestly, like, at least at my age, because like, I, I ain't getting software developer, programmer at this age, I, I know little to nothing about programming, let alone game development, hence why I'm going to university, and another good reason why it's cool for me to have a job. Um, so it's like, honestly, at my current age, right, you know, £8.15 an hour is like, 80p more than my last job was. But then I think it might be more as I like, train myself uh, to do like, different stations and whatnot. Um, no, honestly, literal dream job. I like the food, I like the, like the atmosphere, Colonel Sanders, I love the Spanish Twitter account. Like, it, it is, like, a job that is literally made for me. And I like to think, too, that, um, because I'm on cashier, I think. Like, they start on cashier, and then they train you to do different rules. And no, um, like, I, I like to think, uh, doing this, you know, or just commentating, like, you know, out into the void, uh, you know, like, doing quick thinking, just constantly keep conversation going and whatnot. I mean, besides, like, a few topics I want to bring up here and there, just off a, you know, general, uh, well, that's a 500 fish. Ooh, 
Oh, you can see how it kind of slowed down there, can't you? Mm. Anyway, and what was I going to say? No, I just think that, again, doing this has um, really helps my uh, conversation skills improve a fair bit. And yeah, no, it's um, it's cool. I'm very happy I got the job. I'm um, shouting out to an uh, unnamed person who got me, um, like I said, I was pretty nice and cool because we went to school with each other like three years ago now. So like, yeah, I appreciate you. And if you ever need me to cover your shift, they, they don't watch this channel, but even if they did, I will cover a single shift. <laughs> God, I am. Okay, maybe, maybe it'll, t um, I'll put it up to two. Oh, there's so many weeds there. And if you can't tell, very happy I got the job. Um, there's like a few uh, things, like I'm still kind of held up about, you know, I, th I think nerves come with anything like this, but no, in general. Ecstatic. Uh, yeah, I think that'd be the uh, the right word to explain it. Um, oh, okay, we don't have a, um, a net. We should probably go fix that. Yeah. And then, um, actually, okay, coal was sat down, which is annoying because I'm, um, yeah, well, we'll get back to that, again, again the pot lines, and I'll buy ourselves a net and we'll go from there, and, yeah, it just gives us one extra thing to sell while we're in there, too. <laughs> Zucker's still fishing. And yeah, um, honestly, is there anything else to talk about? Not to my knowledge. I got a great ace turn yesterday, um, this time with my voice intact, and I like to think it's, um, my, my acting's getting better, I'm, I'm getting better at constantly, like, switching between the voices and whatnot. Like, no, I've never went to the floor of that series, and I'm, uh, I'm digging it. It's, uh, it's quite cool, it's quite cool. Like, I like to think eventually, um, because there's the occasional, say, flubbed line, um, in case you don't watch that series, it's by and large not the most popular thing going out, but it's, it's getting a small following. Um, no, um, like, I, uh, I voice like the characters, like, not not excessively, just kind of vaguely. And, like, it was like, oh, I'll do an ouchie voice, for example. And there's like, you know, I kind of just swap between them all. And I'm hoping I can get to a point where I can consistently read all of the dialogue, or at least the vast majority of it, without flubbing a line, and, like, keep going between the voices and have them being consistent. Um, because, again, um, it, it's a weird series. I, like, most series, I don't think about this, but for this one, I kind of had the, uh, the prerequisite where it was like, okay, if this doesn't get enough support, like it's uh, it's getting pulled after the first case, uh, which is next episode. So that'll be that'll be the one that decides its fate, I think. Hmm. Anyway, what's else then here? I don't know. It's it's been good support, so I think I might continue it for at least the second case. Because then all of those series I'll start to hit up on the channel, and it gets a, a fair bit of momentum, and then it might drop off, or maybe it won't. You know how it is. Anyway, oh, I, I haven't spoken to Pietro for two weeks. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so what else is there? Oh yeah, okay. Considering we're in a villager's house, um, I'm really surprised that um, ah, damn it, I had to give me the recipe. Um, no, I'm really surprised that the empty lot hasn't been filled yet. I said it was going to be random, but I don't think that's happening now. So, hmm. Um, we could actually do a villager hunting episode next episode. I'll put I'll put a pin in that and come back to it right before I start recording that next one, I think. That's probably likely. Um, in the event the lot isn't filled by next episode, then I think we'll definitely do that. Like, maybe my game's bugged or something? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Like, there's been no one in the campsite in recent recordings, too, so maybe. Maybe. Anyway. Yeah, so villager hunting might be on the cards for next episode. Anyway. Um, where is Cole? Is he still here? He is! Okay. Um, so it was his birthday a while ago, and I was meant to, um... It's my second time running into you today, the first is in your dreams. Sorry I wandered in my accident. Oh, can I not? We can't give him a gift while he sat down! No! Um, okay. Um, a little bit of a, uh, catch-up for those of you who uh, are wondering what the hell that was about. Um, a while ago, let's see. Yeah, August 10th was Cole's birthday. It's 11 days since, and I haven't given him his gift. Which, for whatever reason, I decided would be this red snapper. It has not made its way to Cole since. So it's like, mmm, yeah, I would like to gift it to him, because he's out, actually out and about. Uh, the last few episodes have been filmed quite late at night, so it's like, mm hmm, maybe, maybe. We'll see, I'm sure we'll get up at some point in the remaining ten or so minutes of this recording. Yeah. I'm actually into to double board, because I've been a day behind for a while. I've had a Fall Guys video ready to go, but it's not, um, not actually gone out. Um, ooh, Animal City's playing in the background. I can dig that. Anyway, just uh, just in preparation for next time. I think I'm going to nab 30 nut mouse tickets. And yeah. Um, no, I've been meaning to give hold that fish for a while. 
and that would mean well, that Fall Guys video for a while, so I'm thinking. Because uh, I decided to go out later tonight, um, I stayed behind because I had a headache and it's like kind of going away, but I have a feeling it, it's going to like come back a lot stronger later, so I'm kind of getting it, getting recording out the way now, doing all the big stuff and then later when, I, when it might be killing me, it's like, eh, it was either because of this or because it was inevitable, but either way I got this out of the way while I still could. <laughs> Does that make sense? It, 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 it just feels like one of those where it'll be an absolute pain to deal with later. Like, even though I like took a nap earlier, it's still kind of there and it's like, hmm. Right, I caught a great white shark. Watch out for its jaws. Jeez. I haven't been in a while since we've caught one of them, isn't it? Hell yeah. All right, more weed. Ah, <laughs> uh, but no, I need to catch up on recording, so I'm thinking. So I'm going out tonight. I might as well just go out regardless, because I have a feeling I'll have a headache either way. Um, I don't think there's much I can do to make it better. Uh, but what I'll do before I go out is I will export this. I'll make a thumbnail for this and the Fall Guys video. And then I'll start this uploading right before I go out. You know, in the, in the name of efficiency, I dare say. Um, b bob you, you can't wait to do what to a fish? <laughs> Look, I know Foy made that joke like 15 different times throughout the series, but I don't care, it's funny. Right, here, fishy, 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 come out of the water so I can taste you. Okay, he's a... He up and the Zucker, the two people I wanted to talk to. The rest of the town are just kind of vibing this episode. So it's like, why, 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 why do you have to do this to me, you two? Why? Shame. It's like that fish that ran away. Oh, but no, I'm thinking I'll be fishing tonight, I think. C catch up on the clothes and I can vibe uh, when I start working. Uh, actually, back on that topic. Um, the, uh, the first few days are like training, so like health and safety course, learning how things work, kind of shadowing people. And then I think after that, they'll start putting me on actual shifts so I can kind of get into the groove of it, so to speak. Um, yeah, it's kind of it's awkward because there's a chance I might have a shift on my sister's birthday. And it's like, I don't, I don't want to go and say to them, like, yeah, yeah, I know you just hired me, but I kind of need to take a day off to uh, go out and celebrate. And uh, my use of the word celebrate implies, uh, you know, we're going out and doing something. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a water slides, baby, so it's like... <laughs> Yo, I'm not sure if that'd be the best introduction to my, uh, my new managers, be like, yeah, um, so I know you've just had me, like, peace. Yeah. Anyway, uh, damn fishing rod bust, so we should, uh, yeah, we'll replace that. And, uh, what should we do for the remaining 12 minutes? Should we, uh, should we watch a KK song? I mean, we can. I mean, nothing, nothing is stopping us, right? Like, we could, we could anyway. Great white shark, Ooh, it's gonna be a mystery until it's uh, all in. All right, how much is it gonna be? I'm gonna say 31,000. Yeah. All right, okay. Okay, practically half. Um, I, I yeah, sure, why not? Why not? I, I thought the shark would be more than that since it's quite rare, but no, uh, apparently not. And again, two tools being bought in a single episode? Cursed, I tell you, cursed. Right, anything else look interesting? No, I don't think so. Okay, well, let's head on. Yeah, um, I think we watch KK songs, we haven't done that for a while, so it'd be cool. And then, in the name of being efficient, I think we might do the outro in a different area than usual. I mean, the, yeah, this could be the outro, but actually, if, See, there's an awful, there's an awful tendency for whenever I sit down for a KK slider song, um, all these villagers get up, so that can that will open up our chance to give Cole his red snapper. Right, well we did, well, yeah, we'll leave it up to him. He's got a slick one for us. Take a seat and we'll jam. Mm. Right on, I'm tuned up and ready to roll. Who's in the mood for old KK marathon? Do we have this one or no? See, so, yeah, they all stand up, but it's like. Ooh, are they going to stay standing after the performance is done? I don't know. Either way, I have a feeling I'll talk through this one. Um, I'm sure it's be efficient. Yeah, this efficiency appears to be the name of the white half of this episode. This is... This is a weird song. I mean, to each their own, but like... Yeah. Yeah, all the other villagers seem to be jamming out. <laughs> just rolled with his eyes closed. <laughs> Snap that. I was like, what? This is a. <laughs> if the petals meant to mean something, I don't think this. Has the song even got, like, started, or is this just the intro? Um. 
Is that like a corrupt song or something? Like, I'm sorry, this is KK Marathon. I was expecting it to be a little bit more upbeat. Um, this feels like I'm being like hypnotized. Like, how how am I meant to feel about this? Why the wait? Wait, this is this, does this count as music? I mean, it kind of does, but like, I mean, you know, yeah, it's got a guitar, it's got a vocalist, but it's like really weird. Like, we're, we're cycling through this. What? What? Is, what? What's in? What? Why is he beatboxing? Why is he beatboxing? See, even, even Roll looks like complete deadpan as what he's listening to. <laughs> so this will this will this will all be worth it if Cole stays standing up after the performance, so I can give him his a uh, very belated birthday present. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so is there anything else to talk about while we're? I mean, all the translation stuff, so we must be near the end, kind of. It depends if, that, if there's that many for every single department or not. Okay, I have a feeling my average viewer retention is about to plummet in this part of the recording. Like, why did you? KK Slider, you couldn't have like put on a banger for me. Like, I know I'll let you choose, but I was expecting something good. You know, something good. This is uh, this is not good. This is. This is, dare I say, cringe. Um, either way, if it, whatever the hell we just sat through is, um, over. Um, he's gonna give us a copy of that and I'll register it solely for completionist purposes. Uh, not because that was a good song by any stretch of the imagination. Okay, that was unreal, thanks for tuning your dial, and nope! Don't you dare. Right, kinda weird how we keep bumping into each other today. Yeah, I saw you turning for that chair. Oh, what are you giving me? Oh, 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 oh I wish I could give you my copy, but I'm not that cruel. Red Snapper. Happy 11 days late birthday, Cole. Is this a really real Red Snapper? I did catch it myself, actually. Thanks, I think it'll be my new best friend. Well, counting you, I mean. Here it is, it's a pilot's uniform. Enjoy. Pilot's uniform? Oh, uh, we'll try this on, why not? Oh, okay, different textures. Okay, I look like a really eccentric party host, and that is not my vibe at all. I know. Like, I mean, I know this isn't like fashionably much better, but mm, I, do I want to look like I'm working at Butlins? Exactly. Anyway, I think that might be cool next one the episode. On we've discussed, um, you know, our job. We've discussed, um, <laughs> you know, everything comes with that. And we finally even called his red snapper. And I think we talked about something else, but I can't remember what it was. So now, um, actually, we talked about being efficient. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so let's uh, not use our McMiles tickets just yet, because we're going to visit Harv's Island. It's been a while since we've practiced an episode this way. But, 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 I mean, hey, hey, like I said, Mr. Efficient. Got to, uh, you know, gonna end the episode by uh, heading to an island. You know, it's, uh, very nice, you know, cool scenery. It means I can uh, do the green screen for the thumbnail and whatnot. It's cool. It's nice. Yeah. I think, uh, once we get this next boarding, we mix ourselves some uh, spicy little thumbnails and we go from there. But yeah, if you did enjoy this one, feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Sorry I wasn't an absolute top form today, like I said. My, my headache's like kind of here, but it's kind of not. Um, I woke up super early for my interview too. Uh, and it's, it's a mix of like multiple different factors. I'm more on that from a busy day in general. I'm sorry if I'm not on top form. Um, I can assure you that now I'm like, my health is fully back. I will try my damn hardest to be on absolute top form for the um, ACCF 100th episode. Um, <laughs> that's kind of why I delayed it in a sense, just so it was like, you know, it, it, it's as best as it can be, hopefully. Uh, you know, now that my throat doesn't sound like it's closing up and, uh, you know, I sound pretty cool, it's like, yeah, hopefully. Uh, we can get ourselves uh, a nice little video going on in there. I think we'll settle all aside, we've, uh, we've got our, uh, our thumbnail ready to go, we just got to make him do the emote, zoom in a little, um, you know, snap a little one of that, start posting it to Twitter, and yeah, hell yeah, I'd call that a pretty damn good rap. So until next time, well said, all that aside, I really do hope you've enjoyed, well bang on 9pm, thanks for watching guys, my name's been Remick, and peace, out.